Hey guys, how's it going? Gonna do a little bit of a different video here, a short one rather. Um, you know, don't want to get too animated with this one. Just kind of want to just touch on this recent news, kind of like real quick. Um, I know other people have talked about it, but I just wanted to get my two cents towards it. A few days ago, Square Enix put out this teaser site for something that's going to be related to the world ends with you. We don't exactly know what it's going to be, but it seems like it's going to be something related to the game, you know, not the anime. They have their own site that's for the anime, and it just seems like, like kind of left field for them just to kind of put this out there, you know, if it's anything that's related to the anime, you know, why not just put any type of updates there? So this is definitely something that's related to the game, and I'm 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 all for it. I definitely um, here's the thing, right? This isn't the first time that they've done something like this, and it's always cool. It's always hype. It's like oh cool, the like more of the world ends with you stuff. Like let's go. What's it gonna be next? Is it gonna be like a sequel? Oh no, it's the phone game. Okay. Oh, it, it, doing it again. Is it gonna be the sequel? Oh, it's it's a switch port you know um and i'm all for this stuff because you know they made the enhancements and it's really cool you know granted the switch port does have its flaws and everything it's not perfect but other than that i think it's still a solid way to play the game i just take some time to get a feel for the motion controls but if that pains you too much definitely the touch screen now when you consider that so many people had their complaints about the motion controls in the game and i think that you know Square by now should have probably like you know addressed that and maybe released a patch like I, I don't think that the game should suffer because of that so many people so many like content creators you know got online and really like vocalized some pretty honest critique against the game because of that and I feel like a lot of that critique could have been like avoided had Square Enix just openly addressed that hey we're listening we, we hear you guys and we're gonna work on trying to adjust that you know, just that one issue, that one issue with the game, that's literally it. You know, just so everybody could, you know, not get online and say just that, just constantly that same thing. And it's, you know, no fault against them, it's the truth. You know, I, I, gotta, I gotta admit, it's the truth. But it's just that it's still a glaring issue with the game, what, like, two years after it came out on the Switch? So, I think that... If this is not the sequel this time, then maybe this is a patch port of Final Remix for the PS4 and the Xbox One. You know, with backwards compatibility, that means you get to play it on the, you know, next gen as well, and that's going to be pretty cool. And what that means is that that has controller support. So if those would have controller support, then that means that the Switch version could also wait. No should also have controller support you know it's not fair for the switch players to be the early adopters and the, you know get the thanks for basically being a beta tester treatment and you know now we're going to release it on the other systems you know with a fix in it that we definitely could release you know on the switch but yeah don't really feel like it don't be that guy I swear nobody likes that guy you know make the right choice and that's gonna be good if if that's what's happening that's gonna be good on its own there because i like to me the way i see it is that it gives more people the chance to you know embrace the the series um because you know with it just being on switches you know, it's really cool they get to take advantage of the touch screen and everything and it's like it's it's just it started on nintendo and it's still going nintendo it's all cool but the truth is, is that there's a feature exclusive to the Switch that's holding the game back from people enjoying the game how they should be enjoying it. So really added in that control support is going to be a great option to those people who, you know, have it on Switch and who maybe wasn't really having the most optimal time with the game the first time around or those people who was thinking about buying it on the Switch or just, you know, anybody else that's on consoles, uh, on other consoles. My bad. Um... Hopefully it comes to the computer as well. I, I just think that, you know, if they're going to put it on PlayStation, if they're going to put it on Xbox, might as well put it on a computer. Just have it on everything. In my opinion, like, The World Ends With You is a game. It's one of those It's one of those games that should be experienced by, like, a lot of people, you know. It just feels like it's one of those niche games that's kind of like Persona. And not a lot of people got the chance to give it a try until, like, you know, Persona 5 and then, like, you know, Joker got into Smash, right? Um, and... 
So many people started jumping on the bandwagon and trying the game. And that's not a bad thing. You know, it's just a really good thing in the end. You know, good for sales and good for more people getting to play the game. So I feel like giving the World Institute that chance to breathe on other platforms is going to do it some real justice in the end. So I think everybody will be a happy camper. If it's not any of that, I mean, I, I'd still be surprised as to what they could possibly throw out. You know, that'd be equally as good if it's... You know, if it's not an update, updated version of Final Remix, if it's not the sequel, then could it be Neku for Smash? Could, could this be their way of kind of like, you know, getting that out there? Is this the next character? I, I'm all for it. If we're not going to get sore, give me Neku. I'll take him. You know, anybody else could complain? That's okay. I'll take him. But I don't know. We don't know. Nobody knows. Besides Square. They know. And we will know pretty soon so i just wanted to make like a super small video you know nothing that was animated nothing that was gonna take too much time just want to quickly throw these thoughts out there and just see what you guys think so you know let me know what it is that you think you know would you like to see the sequel would you want to see an update would you want to see both i'm all good for both neku for smash say it in the comments let me know let's talk about it and you know as usual don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video because it helps the channel and you know with the other bigger videos that's going to be coming along so so yeah also let me know if you like this you know really quick format again it may not be a long video but it sure was quick to sit down and do this out in one go so yeah catch you around